Uh, hello and welcome. Uh, today we have a very special treat for everyone for this uh, first folklore lunch of the new term. Today, uh, um, our presenter from the last term, uh, Marichka uh, Marchik, is joining uh, is joining us for this workshop or uh, celebration. So Marichka is a well-known folklorist, singer, and musician. She collects and beautifully performs uh, Ukrainian folk songs. For 22 years, Marichka has been recreating the authentic singing tradition of the left bank of Ukraine. And uh, really, when she starts to sing, it feels that it's a voice from long, long uh, ago. It really sounds like absolutely authentic singing. In 2002, she graduated from the National Academy of Music in Kyiv, Department of History and Theory of Music, uh, majoring in ethnomusicology. Since then, she founded a number of uh, projects dedicated to Ukrainian music and singing. Marichka performed together with a number of groups including Canadian band uh, Lemon Basket Orchestra and Balaclava Blues. Currently, she leads Toronto-based folk group Calendar. In 2020, Marichka started a digital archiving project, Folk Songs of Ukraine. This collection is available to the public since May 2021 online. She also presented this project on one of our folklore lunches, which I already mentioned. And Marichka, uh, the floor is all yours. Thank you so much. Thank you, our all participants. Thank you for this amazing introduction. Uh, actually, I almost forgot how to uh, forgot how to uh, do a singing workshop because like last two years I pretty much just doing um, like presentation and lectures and but but not singing so <laughs> this is a uh, very very sp special and like forgotten part of my <laughs> my life but I'm really thankful for you guys to to let me do this um, that's my my favorite my favorite thing in my life uh so i would love uh because of the season of course and it not finished yet uh um i would like to uh share with you an amazing ukrainian and not only ukrainian uh and eastern european uh, winter uh, winter songs folk songs tradition and um today it's a special day it's called vasilia uh, and yesterday was malanki it's also that yesterday was a shedri vacher um and uh today it's a like big uh, big celebration big uh, big holiday it's also like a new year <laughs> and when i was younger i remember uh that for me this day was like more important than even to celebrate uh, a New Year's Eve. I always believe that as something very, very special uh, happened <laughs> on uh, the night before, and I like make my wishes and um, always believe that is like some some magic. Um, some, some magic happened this day. So um, please <laughs> make your best wishes. I wish you also to uh, to to be uh, to be positive, to be healthy, uh, to, to to take care of uh, all people who you're living with, who you love, who, for all your loved ones. I wish you all the best in this new year, and uh, I'm grateful to share uh, some singing tonight today <laughs> like i know some people from ukraine for them like it's also night so that is very very amazing thank you uh oh i see my brother from ukraine is here also <laughs> fantastic uh so i will share my screen and uh what i will do today i will ask you guys to mute all your microphones because we can sing and uh, um sing live i can 
I can't hear you uh, like in a normal singing workshop. So this is like a kind of sing along. I will sing for you, you will hear me. I will share an uh, old recordings, original materials first, and uh, you can sing along with your microphone muted. Um, just just with me or after me, like and and watch lyrics in Ukrainian and with a transliteration. I will try to do some translation. What is this song about? That's also a little bit always complicated <laughs> process to translate old traditional lyrics. But I will try to do my best. And if you if you can help me, please welcome. Uh, So you can see my screen now, and I would like to start with an amazing um, uh, carol song, very, very old, um, old one. Like I think it's pre-Christian period uh, carol song because it's uh, telling about, about bees <laughs> and a story. It's a kind of love story about, uh, about bee and about a dove. Um, I, I will go through translation. Uh, and uh, this song was recording in um, Ivano-Frankivsk region from Verkhovina. Uh, district in a uh, Bukovets village. I will share with you, this is actually such a rare uh, um, recording of a, um, uh, like one of the men singing, which is still, this tradition that still exists in uh, uh, Western Ukraine. And so you will see a carol uh, song uh, with, a viol uh, with a violin. amazing carol song oh of course please forgive me i'm not a like a carer and presenter of these particular uh specific uh traditions this specific dialect so i will try to do my best it's always uh good to uh, listen when you when you uh, learning songs it's a it's a best uh best way to um, to copy uh, original materials and try to uh, try to repeat that the clothes to this pro pro to pronunciation to uh, to this mel melody. So um, of course I will try to to teach you, but it's, it's a not specific region <laughs> that I am like really uh, familiar with. So this is very simple uh, melody as you hear. Um, I will show you, it's like one voice uh, carol song. Oh, oh, and I promised to tell you what about this song. So this is a, a song about bee who was flying uh, to, to get some honey and she's stuck in a very, very uh, strong wind and a ship of, like as a result, she like fall down to the water. Uh, and of course, uh, she was uh, screaming and crying and asking for help, but nobody, nobody was around except uh, one um, dove, dove, dove bird. 
uh, who was sitting in an oat, uh, like behind, uh, above this uh, river. And he, uh, he has a very, very nice heart. He was a, such a <laughs> nice person. Uh, and he will, uh, he will help this bee uh, not, not to die. And um, what he did, he just took a um, leaf from this oak tree and uh, gave it to, to the bee. And bee like took, took, this, took this leaf and uh, fly up. <laughs> so this is kind of love story, um, which is very, very, very nice. So you can see um, like before Christianity uh, that there wasn't a, a carol song about, um, uh, about like Jesus Christ, but also about like different, different story, stories. So um, I will show you a uh, first line a little bit higher uh, because like it will be better. I think better most, most, most of participants. The film will have a, like probably like higher female voices. <laughs> Лети лабджола в поле за медом, в наполе тіла у бойні вітру. So this is two lines uh, we'll repeat uh, constantly. So one line, one line starts here. Лети лабджола в поле за медом. And another one, second one, will start uh, uh, from the bottom. And it will uh, it will repeat. In, in, and again, uh, next line will be uh, uh, from the uh, from the top. So let's turn from the beginning. I will sing a little, a little bit slower. Then you can uh, just follow me. It's easy, easy, very easy to repeat song. Leti labjola pole za medom v napole tila u bojni vitru a je naletila u vodu fala u vodu fala taj potopa je vina ratu na kup rosit rida je Nikto na pomiče ne pribuvaje. Oj, sidi v lalup, se vrh vodi v dubi. Nikto ne znaje srce v lalubi. A v tim lalubi je mile srce. A vino rato je bđolu vid smrti. Jak vin pobači bđoli prigodu, urvav les do bakinu v navodu. Bđola silista silno zlapala, silno zlapala, kriljima stripala, kriljima stripala, v goro zletila. At... Um, at the end, so this is a song you can sing even I think from but like with your kids, with your any any people because it's like really really like easy <laughs> carol song to sing and enjoy. I think uh, we can uh, let let's go one more time through this song just to <laughs> feel better, and we will move to another one. Leti labjola pole za medom, v napole tila u bojni vitru. A je v naletila u vodu fala, u vodu fala taj potopa je. A vi na ratunku prositi rida je, nikto na pomič ne pribuva je. Oj, sidi v lalup, se vrh vodi v dubi, nikto ne znaje srce v lalubi, a v tim lalubi je mile srce, a vino ratuje v džolu vid smrti. A jak pobači, sorry, jak vin pobači v džoli prigodu, Urvav les doba, kinu v navodu, 
Бджола силиста, сильно залапала, сильно залапала, крильма стріпала, крильма стріпала, вгору злетіла. Uh, so I, I'm, I hope, <laughs> I hope to hear all you guys, of course, and hopefully one time I will, <laughs> we will all get together, maybe in a, like in some beautiful place and we will all sing these amazing songs but uh for now i hope you enjoy it and let's move to another song uh i will um i don't have an old uh original recordings like field recordings of this song but i have very uh very very nice uh version from um uh rai Horodok um folk band lead by my friend uh from Rebozhecha band Susana Karpenko. So I will share it with you guys. I think it's here. Usually, carolers singing for a uh, for a boy. If it's like in a in a house when they uh, when they come, they they usually know, of course, because it's like the same village. <laughs> uh, but you can also like ask, is it like any young boy um, uh, lives here and they singing a song, especially for dedicated for uh, for this boy. And this, of course, like a, um, most of the Ukrainian folk traditional song, it starts. Like in like a movie, <laughs> like from a from a far away, like behind the hills, or like uh, like it's always uh, starting with our uh, explanation which weather is now, or like what time of the day is now, or like always starting uh, <laughs> uh, about something like abstract. So here. Um, this song starts with the. Uh, uh, like, like uh, somebody asked asking uh, eagle um, with the nice uh, gray feathers. Uh, oh, um, oh, hi eagle! Did you see a uh, cloud in the sky? Uh, 
uh, cloud in the sky and uh, uh, some uh, like people in a village. And in this, uh, um, uh, in, in this village uh, lives uh, in a, a boy named Ivanko. It actually name can change. Uh, obviously, you can ask like oh, ask of the name of the guy who lives in in the house. So the like, here it's uh, we will use Ivanko name. Uh, so Ivanko uh, just walking uh, at home and he's playing. Um, um, so you know, Pichka. Like uh, like please help me. How will how will the word Pichka uh, Ukrainian word how to translate to? Okay. Uh, so, um, oh yeah, so I stopped in the, in the version uh, that about Ivanko, he's like walking in, in a house and he's playing uh, with, a, um, with the cover, you know, like a village, in a village house, it's like a, um, a, like a big oven with, a, uh, with a, like little doors that you, you close, like metal one. And they, that's so he playing these things. It's like when I <laughs> when I ask uh, my friends, like folklorist friends, uh, what it means with Sloan Kihraya. So they describe me. They use usually uh, when it wasn't musicians around for for a Christmas time. Um, uh, people using these metal things like that close uh, uh, oven. They said put it in the ground and use a um, I don't know this word in English, like kocherha, <laughs> like another metal thing, and somehow they like make a sound and do him some rhythm play and sing with that. So Ivanko in this song exactly like probably did the same thing, like they was playing with Slonky. It's actually uh, absolutely like new thing for me, and I, I, I never know what it means with Slonky Hraya, so it's like my new finding. <laughs> And um, in, the, in the next verse, um, the girl is asking, like, young Ivanka, like, who will who teach you to play like this amazing thing? And he answered, like, it was my mom. <laughs> so this is a girl song about Ivanka for like, play nicely with this, like, like a cover, metal cover. <laughs> of um, oven, and uh, uh, of course, it's a chorus that repeat, uh, repeats repeats in every single line. Uh, God, uh, God bless you, and uh, uh, I don't know how to like to, to do the proper translation, like um, how to translate Slava Bogu. Glory to God. Okay, glory to God who lives in the sky, like in the, in the heaven, something like that. <laughs> so every, every single time it's like glory to God who, who, live, who lives, lives in the heaven. Um, so let's think, I will show you to like simple uh, two parts in this song. It's pretty much, uh, that's like one note, uh, a couple notes difference in these lines. Um, I will start with the high high voice and at the beginning. Oh, your lovely is a yeparos love above. You can see like this first line always uh, finishing with a slava bohu. This is like one thing. And another another one, this is uh this is a chorus. So love and yes, nashmele boje no nebesi. Let's repeat the first verse again. Oh, your lovely is a yeparos love above. So love and yes, and I smell a boje no nebesi. Let's do it again. <laughs> oh, your lovely is a yeparos love above. And uh, uh, I will show you a uh, uh, second voice, which is uh, like, I, as, as I told you, it's a like, couple notes difference. 
starts with the same line. Oh, orle, orle, Usually it's one person who starts in the old Ukrainian song. This is tradition. It's the pretty much never uh, uh, even the two people. Usually it's one people who start in that. So I will start this line and then go to the sec uh, to the second uh, second voice. Oh, orle, orle, si pero slava bohu. Sala, no, sorry. Slaven yese nash mele bože na nebesi. And again. Oh, orle, orle, si zeje pero slava bohu. Slaven yese nash mele bože na nebesi. Uh, so I hope like it's um, uh, uh, that this workshop will be recorded. You can also uh, listen uh, it again and repeat and learn uh, learn more. I will not um, stop as I usually like doing it and repeating with the uh, with the real people in the real time. So I will I will show you. You will be able to listen it again. But uh, let's sing an, another verse. I will show you. Um, I will sing a high voice. Dachi bachi vorle na nebi khmaro slava bohu Slaven yese na shmele bože na nebesi Da na nebi khmaro vsele hromado slava bohu Slaven yesi nash mili bože na nebesi. Da po toj hromadje i van pohode slava Bohu. Slaven yesi nash mili bože na nebesi. Da je van pohode će vo slonki hraje. Slava Bohu, slaven jeste naš mele Bože na nebesi. Molode je van koh, to štebe navče, slava Bohu. Slaven jeste naš mili Bože na nebesi. Da navčila mene, matinka moja, slava Bohu. Slaven jeste naš mili Bože na nebesi. Of course, it's, uh, I, will, I will repeat it again and again. It's always better to uh, listen to uh, good recordings. Original recordings is always better, but it, uh, I, I will share it with you, uh, of course, uh, later. All these uh, audio recordings, you can, you can listen it and uh, learn, learn more and more deeply all these amazing carol songs. Uh, so uh, let's, let's move forward. <laughs> So another song, another song is one of my favorite. It's very, very specific song uh, for me because uh, this song I used to sing uh, like almost uh, 20 years ago with the Bozhich Ensemble who I was created. And um, I was singing here uh, with my oldest, now oldest daughter, Katya, uh, who is who was singing in the recording in a um, uh, recording of CD album here? It's it's what I want to show you. You will hear her voice when she was uh, like around six years old, I guess, and now she's twenty five. <laughs> so this is my is my specific memory, and this is this is a song from Poltava region, exactly about um, like how Jesus Christ was born, and this is describing of this holy moment. Uh, in a very, very like, human 
um, human way. It's very, very like warm uh, describing like how it was a very, very, uh, it was Jordan uh, River and with a very, very like quiet uh, moment when it's like nothing, no waves, nothing moved. And uh, there was a mother of Jesus Christ who was, uh, was washing him and he uh then uh, he uh and then he uh cover him into like pelushki and then put like I, I don't know this words actually in english this yeah yes yeah, yeah, probably like it's a, i don't know <laughs> stroller <laughs> uh and then uh and it was a uh, uh, wheels above them and they like breathing uh, nice and quietly and then uh, they took Jesus Christ and put into the um, uh, this uh, oh gosh um, uh, can you please help me uh, like how will be Bristol in English it's like throwing uh huh uh yeah and it was the three angels uh like near him and they were singing a hero like a special heroin song well this is like you, you will hear exactly like how this uh word sounds like and exactly um the song sounds exactly like like this words what i try to translate to you from You can see the lyrics, and I will show you part by part, and then you always can uh, can back and listen recordings. Na yoradanski riči ti kavoda stojala, a tamati boja su sa Krista kupala. I'll show you uh, a beginning, uh, beginning part, and then go to the to the high voice. <clears throat> Let's start again. Na yoradanski riči ti kavoda stojala, a tamati boja su sa Krista kupala. Sorry, it was a <laughs> natural way to sing a uh, middle voice. It, it, no, it's not a high voice. This is a middle voice because usually a person who starts the song goes to the middle voice because middle voice is a, always a main uh, voice line in a, all uh, Ukrainian traditions. So main voice, it's not a high voice. It's always a middle voice. So here is a, uh, I will continue to sing a uh, middle voice for you. А скупавши ушел, шапаве сповила, а сповивши уя уя сельця поклала. And again. А скупавши ушел, а ушапаве сповила, а 
Славивши уя, уя сельця поклала. Uh, I'm naturally mixing voices because I'm singing along. Usually I used to sing it in a group. <laughs> so like also mixing uh, voices, like high voice and middle voice. And think, I think this is a probably natural way when we sing along. And probably it's better for you as well <laughs> to, to sing this song. So let's continue, can continue to do that. А на тими яслами сірі вали стояли, на святе дитятко своїм духом тихали. Взял Иисуса Христа на престоле и поклал ей, а коло престолу три анголи стояли, а коло престолу три Ще святую пісню херуимську співали. Yeah, uh, so see, I, um, I, I already like mixing voices for you, just you can sing along this song, but uh, I also can, can show you different voices, how it's right to sing. Uh, if you want to, to sing it in the different parts with your family and learn it. Uh, so this is for recording. Uh, I, I, yeah. На Йорданській річці тиха влада стояла, а та мати Божа Суса Христа купала. So this was a uh, like real high voice, <laughs> high, high line. And uh, then I will show you exactly uh, in this, uh, uh, using this first verse, I will show you um, a middle voice. На Йорданській річці тиха вода стояла, а та мати Божа Суса Христа купала. And the third line is the bass line uh, with the beginning line. На Йорданській річці тиха вода стояла, а та мати Божа Суса Христа купала. So if you would li like to uh, learn all these lines, so use uh, this, uh, this part. <laughs> uh, and um, we can uh, we can move uh, forward. And uh, I just want to show you uh, more songs, just your, for you to enjoy it, to to get a taste of these songs. And you also you always can uh, come back. And because uh, today it's a, as I told, it's a special day. It's like yesterday was Malanki, uh, who met Vasil. This is very, very, very uh, strong and old um, uh, Ukrainian celebration to celebrate Malanki. And this is a song uh, usually singing in this particular time. Na Malanki, this is like M Malanka song and about a girl named Malanka who, um, uh, I'm using my translation. Uh, shepherd, shepherd, right? So she was a shepherd, uh, uh, two, uh, two dogs, and uh, she lost them, and uh, she she already was she was like no not only them she she was lost and uh she 
uh, as she was walking, she saw a, a guy named Vasil, uh, who, um, who was in a field, and she asked him, like, oh, please uh, take me home uh, back, and I will, and then Vasil, for some, um, somehow, <laughs> magically turned to that, not a real person, not a, uh, not a human, he turned to, uh, uh, like Vasilke, like Kvitochka, like a flower, and she will promise him to uh, garden him in, in her uh, in her gar um, uh, in her ba backyard, and she promised him, like, I will, uh, if you take me home, I will take in care of you. I will, uh, I will water you, and I like do everything, and uh, that make sure you are growing um, better. And and then I will every single uh, Saturday, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, I will uh, put your in my uh, grave. <laughs> it, it's, a, it's a literal translation, doesn't make any sense, never, but it's very, very po poetical lyrics. It's how uh, Winchester's uh, like imagine this world in, in a very poetical uh, way. And um, it's always like a people, flowers and the plants and the trees, it's always mixing together and turning into each other it's absolutely it's absolutely beautiful magical world world so uh, i will not show you a recording of the song because i was learned this song from uh, from my friends from the uh, Braha band a uh, very very long time ago i didn't even lost uh, like where this song particularly uh, particularly from, but I promise to ask them, uh, and uh, I will show with you from which region, re region this song was um, uh, record recorded. But let's uh, let's show you. Uh, actually, this song have a exactly like a previous one. This have uh, has a very very specific a personal uh, meaning for you because we were starting with this song. Uh, our show counting ship about uh, about Ukraine, about um, a revolution of 2014, where I met my husband. So when like people were sitting uh, at the tables with a, um, a huge amount of Ukrainian meals, with the smell of borscht and the huril kasalo and everything, that was waiting for for the show. Like we like open the door and uh, walk walking in and singing this song. So this sound of this song will uh, start to show who won uh, like a bunch of uh, mm, uh, a bunch of awards and uh, in Canada and not only in Canada, all around the world. So this is like a very very famous show we presented in, in, in uh, like a seven countries, including New York, and uh, it's just a huge separate story. <laughs> but this, yeah, this is a song that we start our show every single day uh, for, for many many years. Ой, посла, посла, тай погубила, У чистим опали заблагодила, У чистим опали заблагодил. А в чистим опали плужок, А за тим плужком Василько, Будут тебе поливати 
що субатоньки проривати, що субатоньки проривати. Що суботоньки проривання, ти за русу пасу закладати, за русу пасу закладати. You can, you can sing uh, like uh, how, how you want. Of course, I'm, uh, I'm singing it as in an old traditional way using like open voice how it exists in tradition but you can sing uh like using using your words how you how you can sing like you can sing quietly and okay so don't don't um please don't uh, uh pre, pre, uh, put a pressure into into your voice because you can you can lose it if it's not like in a proper proper way so you can sing quietly <laughs> also <clears throat> let's do it again Ой, учора із вечора Пасла меланка два кагачора Пасла меланка два кагачор Ой, пасла, пасла, та й погубила У чистім палі заблуди у чистім палі заблудив, а в чистім палі плужа коре, а за тим плужком Василько йде, а за тим плужком Василько. Ой, Василю, Василе, Odvedi mene do dola močku, odvedi mene do dola močku, odvedi mene do dola močku, posiju tebe v goro ladočku, posiju tebe v goro ladočku. Буду тебе поливати, що суботоньки проривати, що суботоньки проривати, що суботоньки проривати, за русу пасу закладати, за русу пасу закладати. So, I think, the first singing alone part, like a mix voices that is more useful for you to sing along, but I will show you uh, for this recording, I would show you different parts of this song that you can uh, learn it later. From it, from the beginning. Oh, you chora is a chora, pasla melanka dva kachora, pasla melanka dva kachor. This was a middle part from uh, with the beginning, and then I will show you a bass bass line. Uh, usually, it's a two two uh, functional notes. Oh, you chora is a chora, pasla melanka dva kachora, pasla melanka dva kachor. Uh, so uh, this was an amazing Malanka song exactly for this time. I'm super, actually, I um, uh, wasn't uh, planned to sing this song today, but then I realized it's a special day that it's supposed to be a Malanka song. So I added <laughs> pretty much uh, in the last minute. Uh, and it's uh, already uh, eight minutes. So let's do quickly another song from Poltava region. This is for, um, that is a song when the carolers, the carolers uh, 
uh, come to the house and they wish for everybody uh, who lives there, uh, like all the best and they describing them uh, like in a most beautiful way, how amazing they are. So uh, um, this is a lyrics about like how uh, in this in this yard everything is beautiful, like in a wrist, uh, you know, like like brides wearing this this fantastic wreaths. And uh, this is actually not carol song. This is Shedrevecher song, which is. Uh, exactly as uh, um, uh, people thinking in the, this time and in uh, oh, new New Year's uh, time and Malanka time. Uh, and uh, this chorus, Shedre Vecher, Dobre Vecher, the classical way, Dobrem Ludiam Naves Vecher. And then uh, in a second verse, uh, the, the describing that in this house, and the uh, owner of this cow house, uh, like beautiful as a grape, and uh, his wife as absolutely wonderful, uh, like uh, like wild rose, and their child like a, a small little uh, nice cute flowers. So this is a carol song when uh, the, describing the family, like how beautiful and amazing they are and wishing like all uh, for them and um, for all goodness of the, for a whole year and for, for all good people uh, on this, this evening. <laughs> uh, I think, oops. I had a recordings of this song, but I will show it later. Let's uh, let's sing. <laughs> let's listen first. Of team the Viraco Yakubin Brima Luja Mana Vesevechir Tam Gospodar Yog Vino Grot Shedri Vechir Dobri Vechir Dobri very very wonderful song um i i show you uh now uh showed you uh the middle voice uh I, that is also three multi-part uh, three-part harmony song i will show you recording uh later you can like i just want to save time <laughs> a little bit um for you so uh, let's sing it a little bit slower again like you than this uh, middle voice <clears throat> Of team the Virku Yakovin Kushedri Vecir Dobri Vecir Dobri Maluja Manaves Vecir. 
this is absolutely amazing way how how they uh, sing this like a year uh, uh, every single time like uh, like from from the above and like you like grabbing something and <laughs> uh something amazing like I, it put into your heart the how i feel this song because i always feel it some like in some interesting weird way but i feel feel the music and lyrics like exactly from the way how it was how it was built <laughs> like and I, I hope you will feel the same thing uh so let's continue on the second verse там господар як вино граче дриєвечири добрий вечі іри добрим людям на весь вечі Господиня та яка ли наші дрі вечір, добрі вечір, добрим людям на весь вечір. А діточки та як віточки щедрі вечіри добрі вечіри добрим людям на весь вечір. And I can show you exactly our further recording um, in other voices. Uh, so that was the middle one uh, with the beginning, and I will show you beginning with a high voice. Um, sorry, let's start again. Sorry. So this was a high voice. <laughs> Um, uh, I, I, um, and I will show you a bottom voice with the beginning. So uh, please enjoy this amazing, beautiful uh, Shidrivki and Kolatki uh, and Malanka songs. Um, listen to the original recordings. Uh, you can uh, most of them you can find on the website uh, folk uh, slash ukraine.com uh, in a in a part of like a winter song uh, genre. Um, please write me if you have any questions and uh, hope you will all stay safe and have an amazing wonderful year so I I, I'm thinking that I already like Carol for all of you guys <laughs> and now you can share this tradition with your family with your friends uh, so thank you everybody for coming I actually I prepared to show you and a fantastic absolutely wonderful songs from a um, different part uh, of Eastern Europe but I I did realize I don't have time but it is good so which means I will uh, save something for next workshop uh, what can be dedicated for like, winter tradition not only Ukrainian but the winter traditions from our uh, 
uh, from a different countries and will show you all these amazing songs for you. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, yes, uh, uh, Marichka, thank you so much. It